Mr. Boogie Woogie, uh, also known as Erik Jan Overbeek. I'm from New Vennep, that's a small town in the Netherlands. I play uh, Boogie Woogie, rhythm and blues music for, my, for a living. And I've been doing that for 40 plus years. I heard Boogie Woogie when I was uh, 13 years old uh, on the radio and um, there was a, a blues show uh, from Meta de Vries and um, Weekend Blues was the name of the show and Fats Domino was the first song that she played and she played the Swanee River Hop and after that I knew I want to be a Boogie Woogie piano player. No, there was an old piano in, uh, in the house and um, uh, from my grandma and uh, she got it from her sister when she passed away. Uh, old piano from 1922 and I still have it, still got it. Um, next year it's 100 years old. Well, they think it's a funny name, um, and, and maybe it is, <laughs> but it worked for me. I just figured, well, you know, if I ever play in the United States, then the Erik Jan Overbeek won't work. And um, so, back in the day, in the mid-80s, we, um, all my band members, my first band members, had, uh, had nicknames. Mr. Big Mouth, Mr. Shuffle, DJ the Ladies Man, and they called me Mr. Boogie Woogie, and so I just kept it. And worked for me. Now I was um, trained to be a piano tuner, a technician, and um, I had a piano store in the 90s, and. Um, it was just going downhill fast, and I was playing on the weekends. It got the, the music business got got uh, was going uphill, and the piano business downhill. So it wasn't even a choice anymore. I was you know, becoming a, a professional musician. As 70% of my income was already uh, music. So and I figured, you know what? If I give up rent and all my uh, expenses from the store, just get rid of the store, and I'll be a um, full-time musician. The difference um, solo or with band is that if I don't do anything, nothing is happening. That's pretty clear. So you play in a, in a more aggressive, I play in a more aggressive way. You have to be, you know, it, it, the groove has to continue and uh, sometimes you have to uh, change a little bit. If you, the songs that you're already playing, change it up a little bit so it sounds fuller. Because, you know, there's no bass player, there's no drummer, so it's just... Uh, just me and um, I've learned uh, I've learned that a, a while ago uh, by playing into bars every once in a while by myself and I started to like it I, I'm just an entertainer I just play music for a living and 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 hope people like it and 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 I'm lucky that a lot of people like it as well here in the Netherlands is uh, in uh, Arizona and um, it's just, uh, yeah. I mean, it's not just pure boogie woogie instrumentals. Uh, I like to mix it up and 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 have fun, you know, and entertain people. Have have fun and and make them laugh. That's uh, have a good time.